tired of dealing with constant headaches or nagging back pain, imagine a world where relief is literally at your fingertips. Welcome to that world, the world of acupressure. This ancient technique can be a game changer, offering a natural and holistic approach to pain relief. Acupressure has the power to target specific points on your body to alleviate discomfort and promote overall wellness. Today, we'll be diving into the world of acupressure and how it can help alleviate those discomforts that have been holding you back. Let's start with acupressure for headaches. A throbbing head can really put a damper on your day, but with a few simple acupressure techniques, you can help alleviate that pain. First, focus on the fleshy area between your thumb and index finger. By applying gentle pressure on this point, known as the hoku point in traditional Chinese medicine, you can often find immediate relief. Hold this pressure for about 5 to 10 seconds, then switch and repeat on your other hand. Next, let's move to the base of your skull. Here, you'll find the gates of consciousness points. Using your thumbs, apply pressure in a circular motion. This technique can help release the tension that often contributes to headaches. Another effective point for headache relief is located right on the webbing between your thumb and index finger. It's called the Union Valley Point. Apply firm pressure here and massage in a circular motion. This can help not only with headaches, but also with neck pain and stress. It's important to remember that when applying these techniques, the pressure should be firm but never painful. And don't forget to breathe deeply as you apply the pressure. Deep, rhythmic breathing can enhance relaxation and make the acupressure more effective. Remember, these points can be very effective in providing relief from headaches when applied correctly. So, the next time a headache strikes, instead of reaching for the medicine cabinet, why not give acupressure a try? You might be surprised at how much relief you can find at your own fingertips. Now, let's move on to acupressure for back pain. Just as we did with headaches, we'll start by locating the specific acupressure points that can help soothe your back discomfort. The first one is found in the webbing between your big toe and second toe. Using your thumb, gently apply pressure and hold it for a few seconds. You might feel a bit of tenderness, but that's perfectly normal. Next, we're going to move up to the wrist. Find the point between the tendons near your wrist and press on it with your fingers. This point is particularly effective for lower back pain. So give it a try next time you're feeling a bit stiff or sore. Our third point is located on the back of your knee crease. Here, you'll apply gentle pressure with your fingers and hold it for about 10 to 15 seconds. This can help relieve tension in your lower back and even improve circulation in the area. Now, remember, acupressure is all about consistency. It's not a one-time fix, but a tool you can use regularly to manage and reduce your pain. So try to incorporate these techniques into your daily routine. And of course, it's important to maintain a healthy lifestyle, stay hydrated, practice good posture, and don't forget to stretch regularly. All these factors play a significant role in preventing and relieving back pain. These points can help alleviate lower back pain and bring about a sense of relaxation. So give them a try and let's take another step towards a pain-free life together. Before we wrap up, here are a few additional tips to keep in mind. Acupressure is not just about applying pressure to certain points on your body. It's also about creating an overall atmosphere of relaxation and wellness. So, while you're performing these techniques, remember to take deep, calming breaths. This enhances relaxation and increases the effectiveness of the acupressure. Hydration is another key factor. Drinking plenty of water throughout the day helps to flush out toxins that may be contributing to your headaches or back pain. And of course, good posture cannot be overstated. Make it a habit to check in on your posture throughout the day, especially if you're spending long hours at a desk or in front of a computer. Daily stretching is also beneficial. Incorporating simple stretching exercises into your routine can help prevent discomfort and improve your overall well-being. And the most important tip of all, consistency. Like any other health practice, the benefits of acupressure are best felt when these techniques are performed regularly. So don't just try these techniques once and forget about them. Make them a part of your daily routine and see the difference they can make in your life. Don't forget to like, share, and leave a comment below sharing your experience with acupressure. 
Thank you for watching. And until next time, take care of yourself and prioritize your health.